Hey guys, Kill Supreme here, and we're back with some more Sons of the Forest. So, I'm back at the base. I, uh, I basically gave it a whole in game day, and that golf cart did not recharge, so I've had to ditch it and leave. I ran back home, and I am here. So, what am I thinking of doing today is I'm thinking of giving V her own house, basically. Can't believe we're down to one car. That sucks. Let's check the charging on this one, actually. Yeah, I'm going to build V a house. Perfect. That's absolutely fine. We're going to build it somewhere in the camp. Uh, I'm not entirely sure where. I'm thinking like here, down here somewhere. Like kind of in the corner over here. Just a nice little house. Make it look nice. Nice little porch. Get it going. I want to plant up the crops, but there's no point in doing it yet because it's winter time. This is going to look amazing when it's summer. Unfortunately, can't do that right now. I kind of want to. I might increase that up there, though. I might mess around with that a little bit very soon, but I'm thinking here. Obviously, I'm going. I don't really want to incorporate it into the side of the building because it's only going to be a little hut. I don't want to build like a, a huge, huge ass house and then have to rip down part of the base just to get it built. I've had enough of ripping down the bases at the moment. I don't want to do it again. So I feel like I'm going to try and edge this as close to the wall as I possibly can. Maybe if I just put that in there. And then uh, we'll go from there. I just don't want to have to rip down kind of like the sections of the base just to get it working, you know? I'm going to lay out a... I don't even know where they are. They're not even on their way. They're still across the other side of the bloody island. Look. I put a marker down, though, where the golf cart is because, well, now I know where it is. I can go get it, can't I? Let's get this laid out and see if we can get the blueprint of this done. All right, so I've got the outline roughly sorted of where I want it, and now I'm just going to replace it with stone because I feel like... I kind of like the foundations of buildings made out of stone. It's more supportive, I suppose. Gives it a bit more support, more structural integrity. When the cannibals, if they get in the base, which they generally do quite a lot, won't be able to just smash it apart, you know? Uh, going by... What is this? Uh... 5x3 by, by the looks of it. I think it's a 5x3. That way, I can get a nice centre part in through a door. Might even be able to get some decking. I could potentially incorporate the decking area into this. I don't know if it will work. It might because it's kind of a bit separate. It might work. I don't want to have to increase it by like a quarter log all the way around. Kind of get it going all the way around down here. My plan is to bring it in down here and kind of connect it up to this part here for the garden. Because I've got this section that needs to be filled in anyway. If I can get it kind of blending in with that, that would be great. I could do with a Calvin though, because wood needs to be got. And uh, stone needs to be got. And I'm not doing it myself. I'm getting him to do it for me. Because I'm lazy. Alright. That's the square done. I feel like we should get some wood down. Maybe sort out the uh, the decking area first. I kind of like the idea of that. At least that way we've got kind of like roughly where we want it. But I don't know. I am going to be able to do that. Yes, I can. I can bring the decking area. It's going to be slightly higher than the actual wall itself. But that's fine. It's because I haven't connected it up. It's kind of just really close to it. So if I do that, am I going to be able to get kind of like my stone pillars in place and fill it in? Should be able to. Yeah, I can. I can put one in there. One there. One should be about... It's a bit glitchy. Yeah, there. And then one there. I can. That's good. I can do that. Well, I mean, it's going to be uh, it's going to be wood anyway. Wood, wood columns because I'm trying to blend it in. Although, I've just realised what I've done. I need to take them out because I've just connected it into this column here, haven't I? That needs to go. Ditch that. This is why I've got to try and blend it in, because there's no way up the stairs unless you have that really weird system that I've built. And I don't want it to use that. I want to be able to get up the stairs. You can't unless you jump. I heard some cannibals, and as we haven't got a V, I'm going to have to deal with it myself. I thought I heard some. Where are you going, love? Where are you going? Don't run away. Oh, did your mate die? He did, didn't he? Oh. Wow. What's, what? It, okay. Ow. Hi. 
<laughs> okay, you have a little mental breakdown on What the hell is going on? What is that? Is that a club? Yeah, it's the club. It's just follow me around. I think that was it. Just the one then. Oh, sounds like we got demons. They've come to the right place. Oh, that one's dead. Set on fire anyway. Nice and crisp. There we go, guys. How many of you are there? Four. You're the only one left. Ah, uh, you're in a corner. Ow. All right, well. Oh, that didn't go to plan, did it? I'm so glad I built these spike walls. Uh, I just wish I didn't get lazy doing the spikes. Because, you know, they're a pain in the ass. Having to do one at a time. And then put three stone rocks down to secure the bloody thing. And then chop it up so it goes into a point. I'd love it if you could just click one area. Click another area. Blueprint it. So it's just like there. And then just get Calvin to do it for you. So you haven't got to go do it yourself. You know what I mean? It's not much easier that way, I think. Instead of doing it individually. If I didn't do it individually, I would have had a lot more spikes there. Ooh. Right, so change of plan. I had to bring it forward because I couldn't line up the uh, the decking area. So I want the decking area to kind of... Come on. Come on. Start off. Stop connecting to stupid things. There we go. I want the decking area to kind of go like that. All the way around, but... I couldn't do it before. It weren't lining up properly. The uh, the building was slightly further back and a little bit lower. But it should be okay. If I do this all the way around, it'd be slightly higher than I want it. Slightly further out than I'd want it to, to be honest. But I think it's going to be a bit, a bit too far out, isn't it? Mm, this is a bit annoying. I'd have liked that incorporated into the back of the building, but... I don't want to rip down the back walls again to build a house. So I'm just gonna, I'm not going to do it. I'm just not going to do it. But that's going to come out to about here, which is going to... Do you know what? Sod it. I don't care. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm building it that way. It'll all come together anyway. It always does eventually. Right. What I need to do now is I need to increase this by one all the way around. And then see if I can get it kind of sunken in. Have the inside a bit lower. I might not actually, because when it snows, you'll see the snow in the base, and that'll suck. Okay, so here is our first problem. Problem number one. The decking for the greenhouse is uh, lower than the decking for the house. <laughs> okay, I'll try and get that in there somehow. Maybe, can I... I cannot take that out, but if I support that corner part... With a couple of struts. Let's get one in there. Like that. And if we get one in there. Like that. Oh, it's still not going to work, you know. Because behind here is going to be lower. And then this is going to be higher. And I can't get all of them out. Hmm. That means that deck in there has got to be lower. How about... I think I might have an idea... If I bring the decking down here, I can bring it into the lower parts, which are there. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to have to work this out. Let's get rid of some of this. Like that, basically. And then have this as the lower section. I think that would work, but that means I've got to dismantle this part of the wall. It's getting dark. I tell you what, I'm going to build throughout the night, because although I do want to get rid of the winter season as quick as bloody possible, because it's annoying, right? I, uh, I kind of want to murder some... Raving cannibals. I haven't seen them for a bit. I kind of miss them. But the plan is that, right? So, what was that? Was that just you? Or am I getting attacked? It's just a Calvin. Please don't steal all my stones, mate. I know I told you to get some, but I kind of need them. Right, so I'm thinking... That over there, like this, works perfect, right? So, if I just turn that into a slope, lob that in there like that, I should be able to get the wall section back in and then join that up. That would work. That gives me the little slope that I need to go for the decking. What's the matter, Calvin? You're missing some stones? That's mine. Get off. I saw you coming around for it, mate. I love how V's getting an entire house and Calvin just lives under the stairs. <laughs> well, he deserves it, to be fair. He does work a lot harder than V at the moment. V's just walking around. Right, this should work then, I suppose. That should work, yeah. 
I think that would work. And now all I've got to do is... Yeah, that will work. Just put a log there. Join this up with here. And then that will be flat. That will bring it down and around. And then we can just walk down here. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Love it. Let's lob that away. We don't need that anymore. Ah. That is why i done the decking before I built the side of the house. Because I just knew that I'd screw it up. And then I... Uh, I'd have to take it all down again and do it again. Which is rather annoying, right? Let's just dump that in there. Ah, night time. Love the way this base looks at night. It just looks cool. I just wish we could render the lights in, like, over there. But it just won't let me. There's no way I can get the lights to appear from a great distance. I think. I'm gonna... Oh, look it up. Actually, there might be a way. Oh, I couldn't figure out a way. I don't know if any of you guys know how to do it. Like... I can see these lights and these torches are fine, but I can't see them. If there's a way to edit the game files in any way that allows me to see further and actually light up the whole base, uh, if you could let me know. I don't know if there is a way, because as it stands, I need to get pretty close to these lights just for them to shine, you know? And I've got my graphics turned up to max, so if you guys know... Pop it in the comments. That would be great. I'd love to be able to light up my base. Plus, it will work better for when I do my nighttime uh, base tours, you know. She put a fish down somewhere. B, where is it? Ah, oh, there it is. Thank you. It's been very quiet on the cannibal front. I don't like it. There ain't any. It is now... 9.25. And there's not been a single cannibal attack for tonight. You coming in, V, or are you going to stay out there? All right, well, you patrol the perimeter. I'll stay in the base. I mean, they can get in anyway, can't they? They know how to get in and out of the base. Right, this is what I'm looking at so far. It is taking shape, actually. I feel like I need to get the walls in place so I know where I kind of want things, you know? And at least that way we can frame it. I've chosen to raise the floor on the inside. He just keeps giving me sticks. Uh, because I know when it snows and stuff, it's just going to all shine through. It's all going to come through. You're not even going to see the floor. I don't want her to have like snow all over her floor. You know what I mean? That would look horrible. Nope. Completely wrong place. No, come on. There it is. going to have to rip that up, though. That's going to have to come up. And that. So I can get that in there. There we go. Perfect. Oh, I can't get a... Uh, right, well, I'm going to have to cut that down and then replace it anyway. No, let's do that now. There we go. Get that out. I need another log. Damn it. Right, I've had to do that across the back uh, because I couldn't get the, uh, the post back on there for some reason, despite the fact that that is still connected to this. It wouldn't let me put that on top. So I've had to do like a little row around the back. I might even do it around the whole house. Uh... No, I won't like it, actually. I think it'll look horrible. I'm going to do it down the back wall, so she's going to have a nice, fancy back wall area. No one's going to see it, are they? I hope. <laughs> right, uh, let's crack on. I'm getting fed up with jumping over these bloody things, though, so I'm going to do the floor first. I've still got plenty of wood up there anyway, and I can go out and grab some more. So it should be all right. Right, what way is that facing? That's going to go that way, so we'll copy that. We'll just get this field out as quick as we can. Right, frames up. Now I need to figure out where I want the entrance to be. I'm thinking, what, that's three, three, two on each side there. So I'm guessing, like, here is going to be the ramp up. That's going to be the front door. Um, so we can get that into place. If if you pick up stone, that would be absolutely amazing. There we go. To be fair, this house would be absolutely freezing during the snow. It's Oh. What? Why did that... I don't even know. I don't even know. The floor just turned into actual proper flooring. Instead of snow. Well, this is going to... Uh, it takes so long to place stone. What the hell is going on over there? That's a bit buggy, isn't it? What was that? It's like a... F a flock of birds just flew past. Surely... What the hell? Am I seeing things? 
I don't even know if I've got it all on camera. I'll have to have a look back. But that was weird. It was almost like a flock of birds just uh, flew past or across the floor in my base. But I don't know where that went. No idea where they went. I think they went into here. They just flew in this direction. So strange. So strange. Never seen that before. Uh, I don't know what Calvin's doing. He's meant to be getting logs, but I think he's given up, to be honest. I think he's just chilling upstairs in the bedroom by the fire. Let's have a little look. Aha! Busted! Get your ass outside and get some logs. He's just going to look at me. Yeah, that's right. Try and intimidate me. I'm your boss. Bit of a weird way of going through a door, but get you out there. Go on. Little sod. See that? He's just chilling upstairs by the fire. I'm meant to be outside getting me logs. Just can't get the staff these days. Right, anyway. <laughs> Before I, some weird things happen and then more weird things happen. I've got the walls done. That was a bit of a pain in the ass. So I had to rip the floor up, take down the things and then rebuild it again. But what I'm thinking of doing is just smashing a couple of windows either side of the doors. There, one there. And then basically put some around the base but i i uh i want to get a fireplace in here like i've done over there as well so i want to get a built-in like chimney area which is going to look nice he's going to have low roofs it's not going to be like a really high roofed area all right where am i going to do the windows i'm going to have two there i'm not going to put a door on the side she only needs one she doesn't need multiple doors and i feel like I might leave the back wall whole and i'll smash her oh i missed one well, that could be fixed, can't it? Here we go. Fixed it. And I feel like we'll smash a hole here. There we go. And then a hole back here. Keep the corners solid so we can fill them in. There we go. Perfect. Nice. Now she can look at the garden. She can look out a window to see if Calvin's being a weirdo. Kind of perving on it. Come on. There it is. You watch. After all this, you probably won't even stay in here. Right, I need to get uh, a chimney in place. So in order for me to do that properly, I'm going to have to rip this floor up again. I should have done it earlier. Because I need to get a beam in going across that way. And it won't let me do it unless I rip the floor up, which is irritating. But it's fine. So as long as I strip it right back, it should be good. I need a log. Uh, there's one here. That'll do. We'll put that in there, like that. Now I can do that, and now I need to get this back in. So, how I built the fireplace in the last base was like this. Uh, I'm, I've got to find it first. Let me find it. I think it was in utility. There it is. Get the fireplace. I've just basically done what people said. You can place it and, uh, not have to worry about building it yet and then you can build kind of around it and then build the fireplace so what i done was i built it quite close to the front like although i can actually get that quite a bit into the wall to be fair i want it into the wall but not too much into the wall so like say about there all right let's get some stones we'll build up a little wall around that and we'll see what the gap's like Right, yeah, no, that gap's too big. So we'll get rid of that. And then we'll get another one. And we'll try and squeeze it in. So it kind of protrudes a little bit, but not too much. That looks all right. That looks like it might work. Might even go better if I move it over. No, that looks fine. I'll keep it in the corner. Still think it's a bit much. I still think that maybe you can see down the gap. All right, I'm going to experiment with this a little bit. I will get it nice and flush. There we go. Perfect. That is absolutely perfect. Now all you do is build your wall. I'm going to build the strut across the top first, though. Then I'll build my wall. It's going to take a little bit of time, and night time is coming. I'll have a sleep. Just to power through this bloody winter period, because, let's face it, everyone hates the snow period in this game. Well, I mean, I don't know if you guys do. I love the way the snow looks. I just hate it when it's snowing. Oh, at last, it's raining. Oh, that can only mean one thing. Oh, winter is done. 
Thank God. Bloody hell, the winter period's horrible in this. Can you imagine playing on a hard mode and having full length winters? That would be a horrible rotten meat. A horrible thing. Lucky for me, I've got plenty of food. I just don't have much stuff to store water in, I'm afraid. But it don't matter. Ah, screw you, Snow. We can get the plants in now as well. That will be good. Yes. Nice. Nice. I prefer it like this. This is getting on well. I built the uh, the fireplace. I don't know if that looks crooked. And I'm not too keen on the gap across the top, but I can't really get rid of that. But, uh, however, I will get this fire up and running just to make it look cosy. Even though I was chucking it down indoors, but it don't matter. Oh, uh, because it's sunny. It will be. Anyway, there we go. Get some logs on that. Ah, there we go. Fireplace is active. It looks nice. I should have just built it there, to be honest. Mm, I don't really want to take it down and change it. I like it like that. That's how it's going to be. Fireplace is going to be there. Sod it. I'm not building it there. Right. I don't know what Calvin's up to, but I need him to get more wood. Uh, I haven't seen him for quite some time. I think he's done a bolt. So I'm going to do an upstairs section now, I think. I think I might have the stairs going here. So you go up to the next level, and then this will be like the bedroom. Hopefully. Just as soon as I find out where the rest of my wood is. I've got stuff everywhere. Calvin, I need wood, mate. Right, fine, I'll get wood me bloody self. He's not doing it. I think the only way I'm going to be able to... I can't even lob it out the window anymore. The stones are in the way. Ah. Oh. I used to just throw it out the window like this, but I feel like the stones are causing issues. Uh, no, I can still do it. It's just really annoying. I need to get... I'm stuck. I need to get a way of, like, literally just being able to get in and out easier. Maybe a zip line through the window will work, but I'll just lob it off the balcony for now. Unless I build a balcony across there. No, that won't work. I mean, it will. Because then all I have to do is knock a hole in the wall, get rid of one of those stone holders, and just run it off the balcony, right? And then I can get stuff up there a lot easier just by lobbing it up to the balcony instead of running it up bit by bit, you know? I don't mind. Gives me something to do. Oh, it's cannibal crying season. Let's have a little look, shall we? See what's going on out here. Hi, guys. I don't agree with that. Like, I hit him on the weapon. Therefore, it counts as a block. Despite the fact that he didn't even have his block up. Oh. Shut up. Yeah, I've noticed that a lot. If you hit them on their weapon, it counts as if they've blocked it. Which is not good. That's poor, poor design. In order then for the block the attack, they should have their arms up ready to block. Not by default hit a weapon automatically block it. I've had to take that down from above the door because you can't open and close the doors with that there. It overhangs too far. It gets stuck. I don't even know. I don't even know what he's doing. I don't even know why there's a log there. Ooh, I thought I was going to hit him with it. All right, I'm going to go build. I'm always one short, you know. I've either got one extra or one short. Never enough. I don't know if I like that fire there. I might move it. I don't know. I'll see about that fire. I'll think about it. Alright, this is the last lot of wood. Well, it's not the last lot of wood, but I've got more. This is the last lot of wood I've got in the bloody thing, though. So much empty stuff. Calvin's just strolling around. I'll have to save, exit, and come back in again and get him to pick up some more, more logs for me. That would be nice. Not logs. Stones. More stones. That's the one. Heavy logs. Get these down. Get our little, uh, in case you're wondering what I'm doing or what I'm going for, I'm going for it. This is not your house. Bugger off. This is V's. She loves it, don't you, V? You like it? Come on. Casually sneak under the stairs. It's going to be a little balcony. So this is going to be like a raised platform, kind of like a bed area. Can have a little seating area downstairs. It's going to look great. It's going to be so cosy. So cosy. Need to go back, get some more wood. Never lasts long. There we go. 
Right, I moved the fireplace. I didn't really like it where it was, and you couldn't really see it. I feel like it's in a better location there. So that will do. I blocked the window in round the back as well. But I need to re-add it because I've moved the fireplace. So at least Calvin can pick up that stone. Right, what do I need to do? I'm going to roof in now. This is about as high as it's going to go, to be honest. So I just need to put so put roof across it. We'll do that. Oh, loads of stone, loads of logs over here. Eh. Get that sorted. Get the place looking nice. Roof it. Done. This is taking quite some time, but it's worth it. It just, it just takes so long just to build even a small cabin. Just start sticking to like a 2x2 two two and have done with it. <laughs> Instead of building like huge bases like this. It's the simple 2x2 two two will look lovely. What you got for me? Give me a gift. Thank you. I can't really pick it up though. I'm kind of full of all herbs. Thanks though. Bye. Okay, so basically got fed up of um, building the inside of the house. So I decided to do the outside a bit. I've got the deck in sorted over here. Got it all sorted down here. It kind of leads straight up there. It blends in quite nicely. Had to fill this gap in, so I had no choice but to kind of put a deck in there. I might wall this off. Might not. I think I might, though. I just, or at least give it a roof all the way along. It will work to about here, then it kind of go down over here. I won't be able to do it because it goes up a little bit. Uh, we've got the slope going up here. It leads her around to the front of her house. We've got that part there. It leads into the stairs, which is nice. Still need to add a window. Tell you what, I'm going to do that now before I bloody forget. Smash that in and then Calvin and collect the stones. There we go. Nice window there. I need to get the window frames up, like the shutters. But as you go into a house, you've got the overhang part that will be the bedroom upstairs. You've got like the hanging out area downstairs. I'm going to block this off with wood so you can't see it. She's got a fireplace. I prefer that location. Um, thank you, I guess. Can I, can, can you just, can I, there we go. That's what I'm after. There's a bit of a personal space issue there. V, you know, bit, bit squashy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you. She likes the house. Uh, and then, yeah, upstairs, you go up here. This will be the bedroom. Basically, all I've got to do now is stick a roof on it. Um, but I'm going to do that next time because I've been building quite a lot this episode. So I'm just going to put struts. Some support beams from left to right across here. It's going to be one high. It's not going to be any higher. And then I'm just going to go kind of like a quarter log into a half log. Like, a, yeah, maybe like, nah, just go. I might just go half logs. Straight up, half log, and then back down again. And then just fill it in. Both sides. I'm not going like a huge roof. Don't need it. I think a quarter log will be a bit small, but half logs will go nice there. Got to get the railing in for the stairs but i mean i'm completely out of everything right now i need to get calvin to get more of everything i've got a tray of stones over there but that's about it a tray sledge tray whatever but uh yeah I, I like it it looks good it's come out quite nice it's a bit of a fancy house for her to be honest considering calvin's living under the stairs she's got her own two-story bedroom <laughs> house <laughs> with a with a Kind of like a decking area. Don't even start, Calvin. Walk away, mate. Walk away. He did. He listened to me. Well, okay. Well, I'm going to leave that here. We need to get this planted up as well at some point. I'll get that done as soon as I can. I love this. I love the way it looks. It's come out really nice. This this entire base is brilliant. I love it. So thanks for coming, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see some more, subscribe. I have a Discord as well. Link is in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for coming. Bye. Mm -hmm.